Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So another day, another another YouTube video. So today I'm doing a get ready with me. It's a chit chat get ready with me. I'm going to answer a few questions. I've searched on the Google um, a tag questions for YouTube. So I will just randomly answer some questions that is there. So you guys get to know me a little bit. If I can answer the questions, sure, I will definitely answer them. So, yeah, let's get right in. Okay, guys. So, before we start, just a little bit of disclaimer. I'm not a makeup artist. I didn't study makeup or I didn't learn anything about makeup. This is just through experience, through what I watch on YouTube. So, yeah, this is just a normal girl putting on her makeup okay so let's start i got all my makeup goodies here if you can see i'm going to show them to you one by one when i use them so i just keep it all here whatever i'm using and there's a mirror over here on my right side so if you see me looking towards this direction it means that i'm just using the mirror so i can see myself while putting on the makeup okay so let's start the questions are right here so i will just if you see me clicking here as well, it means that I'm just reading the questions. So, let's start. Okay, so first off, guys, you know, there is still a pandemic. So, use your sanitizer, wash your hands first. So, you will be set to use your hands while using the makeup. So, what I usually do is that I put on my skincare first, of course, and then I use this... Pixi Glow Mist with Propolis and Argan Oil. This is the nourishing mist. I just mist this all over my face so it feels a little bit hydrated. Let's settle that in. And then while you are making that dry, I use the... What's this? There's a hair, sorry. I use this um, Fresh Beauty Sugar Rosé Lip Balm. This is the one that has SPF 15. So when you are going out, it's I, I feel like it's better to use this one. So, okay. Let's also answer some of the questions now. First question is, where did you grow up? So I will just answer the questions while putting on the makeup, okay? So where did you grow up? I grew up in the Philippines. Well... If you don't know, I am half Filipino and half uh, Black American. My dad is Black American and my mom is Filipina. So, my dad um, studied or like took his degree in the Philippines. He studied in the Philippines. So, he's, he took his doctorate degree in the Philippines in the University of the East. So, that's where... He and my mom met, so he stayed in the Philippines for a while. So that's why most of the time we, we like, I mean, I grew up in the Philippines. So yeah. Okay, so first off, I'm using this Bobbi Brown um, face base. Vitamin, vitamin E face base, yeah. I got this as a, like a gift during a Sephora shopping so i'm just trying it out and see if i'll buy the full size so anyways let's put this one over the face i just use my hands to be honest like i cannot be bothered i think i need to put on some clip wait a minute just wait so i i don't want my hair to go all over my face you okay, guys so i'm just putting clips here so my hair wouldn't go to my face okay let's continue okay so i already put the vitamin e face base from bobby brown next will be for you guys do you use um eyeshadow first before foundation or foundation first for me i put the eyeshadow first it's just i just got used to that so yeah anyways where do you currently live so i currently live in the uae so i'm using this for my eyes 
this is my favorite nowadays but apparent like unfortunately i broke one of the eyeshadow palettes anyways this is the pixie eye palette in the double top okay so i'm currently living in the uae specifically in dubai who is your first best friend first best friend that's really difficult question i don't remember now but who is my first best friend i don't really remember to be honest Mm. I don't know because I remember during elementary we have like a group group of friends and we are maybe 9 or 10 I'm not sure yeah in a group so we are a lot my closest will be who is my closest maybe tiny that time I always go to her to their shop and visit her. I remember. Next question: How tall are you? Well, I am five seven and a half, five feet and seven inches in centimeters. How? What is the centimeters equivalent of five foot seven? Let's check one minute. It's 170, 170 centimeters. I'm tall, but I mean not, not much. It's normal, I think. Okay, dogs or cats? Definitely cats. I have a cat right now. Her name is Happy. We adopted her and she's really adorable. And then I just go right in with a little bit of like darker shade on the outer corner. I'm just putting on like an everyday makeup look, not really like something, you know. I just drag it a little bit on the outer corner because I want it to be to look that my eyes look a little bit, you know. Okay, so I'm done with that. I will retouch it later. And then next is I put on um, foundation. So now I'm using this Too Faced Born This Way foundation in the shade Honey. Funniest moment throughout high school. Oh my god, there's so many things that I cannot remember already, but there's for sure a lot of things. Hmm. Funny, yes. Let's think about one. Hmm. Maybe... I'm just trying to remember. I remember before during high school, I was part of the cheating squad. <laughs> and, and I'm very tall. So can you imagine, like, in cheating squad, you need to carry the girls. Like, the guys needs to carry the girls. And I remember, like, it, it was always hard for the girls, for the guys to carry me because I'm so tall. Even during high school, I'm already one of the tallest. So, yeah, most of the time, we always fall down and stuff. I guess that's really, that's not quite funny, but I mean, it's a little bit embarrassing and I will never forget those times. Another thing, oh my God. I remember during high school, we started drinking. Oh my God. We started drinking. And there was one day we didn't go to class. We cut class just to drink in another person's house. And I mean, you know, during when you were high school, you like to experiment things and stuff. I mean, I'm also one of those kids. I mean, yeah. We cut class then we were drinking in another person in an one of the person's 
with us in their place and then she became so drunk and started doing crazy things oh my god and then the neighbors i think reported us or something and then it came to to the school our parents was called to the, to the principal's office and like we had some We got like um, warning because of that. I mean, I will never forget that experience, really. Okay, so guys, don't forget your neck area when you're putting foundation because you don't want your face to be different color than your neck. Okay, so I'm done with the foundation using the brush the next thing i do is just i just go back again with um beauty blender i just feel like it lasts longer like this i don't know if it's just me or other people also doing the same okay next question will be what year were you born Hmm, am I going to disclose my age? No, just kidding, yeah. It's not, not an issue for me. I'm born in 1985. Are you or have you gone to college? Yes. I have a degree in um, commerce, major in applied economics. So I studied in St. Scholastica's College in the Philippines. And it's an all-girls um, college during my time I mean now I think it's co-ed it's I mean it's a mixed college now but during my time it's exclusive for girls okay so while this is drying out I actually do my eyebrows uh, sorry, sorry, no. I put on the concealer first, then after that, I do my eyebrows because I, I let the concealer marinate, to be honest. I let it stay for a few minutes before I blend it in. This, are, this is how I put on the concealer. I just put a lot here and here. And then around my nose area, in the mouth area. And then here. And then while marinating that in, I, uh, I didn't show you. I'm using the Becca Ultimate Concealer. This is in the shade Honey, Honey as well. So yeah. And then after that, I, I do my brows and I use this Benefit Precisely My Brow Pencil in the in number 5. This is my favorite. So I just go ahead and draw my eyebrows. So let's answer another question. What is your favorite drink? What does drink meaning alcohol or normal drinks okay let's do both normal drink i like peach iced tea lemon iced tea alcohol i like uh bullfrog and wine guys excuse my eyebrows i didn't go to the salon yet because I'm going to do one procedure that I'm going to film next week. So stay tuned for that. So I'm just growing out my eyebrows for now. Okay. What is your spirit animal and why? I actually like elephants. This is started when we... Uh, went to Thailand. I don't know what year was that. We went to Thailand and there is this elephant sanctuary that we went to 
and I feel like oh my god elephants are so underrated they are so powerful they are so strong and they are so like they are so adorable at the same time you get me like nobody really notices them it's like they are yeah elephants big like this but most of the time people chooses like lion or tiger as their spirit animal but for me i feel like elephant are so underrated and they're actually very smart as well is that the same it looking the same let's brush a little here i just want it to look natural like i didn't put anything at all I think there is still a gap a little bit on this side okay I'm done with the brows now let's blend the concealer while blending let's so another question you're wearing perfume what scent it is definitely my Burberry black perfume I usually that is my favorite perfume of all time and yeah I will always have that in my perfume collection for sure that will never run out I love that every time I wear it, I get like tons of compliments or people ask me what perfume I am wearing. Tea or coffee? Definitely coffee. What are your life goals? I really, really want to have my own house and start a business. I mean, I don't want to work forever, so... I feel like having a business is really the way to go and sometimes I regret why I didn't start young why only like I'm thinking about it now oh well it's never too late what sports do you play or have you played I was part of the volleyball team during high school I was just a substitute but I was part of it so I was playing volleyball before so and part of the cheering spot. I, I, feel, I feel like I was really, what do you call this? Health, not health buff, but sporty, little bit sporty. When I was in high school, I was even part of the military cadet for high school. Oh my God. I cannot imagine like when I was joining all these extracurricular activities and it's like mostly strenuous, extracurricular activities but yeah i enjoyed playing volleyball during the time and shooting squad as well we always were the champions so i really had fun okay how many books you read changed your life definitely one book that changed my life was the one from Paolo Coelho, The Alchemist. If someone read that as well, comment down below. But that is my favorite book of all time. Then after that, I also read By the River Piedra. I sat down and wept. That was also really, really nice. It was really amazing. Okay, so after that, I just put on the, I just put on some powder to bake. To bake my under eye. And my nose area because I always sweat. I also put my forehead and here 
Oh my god. After that, I put on my blusher and bronzer. So I'm using my Sunny's Face Air Blush in the shade Moon. I really love this because it stays long, um, longer on my face. I have an oily skin, if you don't know. I have oily or sometimes combo. Now it's summer here in the UAE, it's very hot, so I'm definitely having so oily skin. And then after that, I put on just a little bit dab of this clinic cheek pop just a little bit and then i go in with this bronzer this is the hula bronzer from benefit Just to create this like fake cheekbones. And then I go on and put in my forehead, of course, to make it look small. And then here. While I'm still baking my under eyes, I just draw in my nose, a little bit of contouring because as you know, your girl's not having a tall nose, so. It looks like it's so obvious but after when we blend it in it will go so yeah next question do you speak any language any language and how well mm -hmm. I only speak Tagalog, English, and a little bit of Russian. That's it. Spanish, I mean. Some of the Filipino language are like already Spanish originated, originated like the, from their language. So maybe partly Spanish. So. I'm dusting this from my eyes now. Okay, are you single or taken? I'm taken. I'm engaged actually. How long was your longest relationship? My current relationship is the longest. We met each other since in 2009. Now it's 2020, so it's more than 10 years. Uh, how would you describe your fashion sense? I feel like my fashion sense is a little bit laid back now. I'm trying to invest in items that are more on the classic side. I don't want to be like always into f in fashion or something, whatever is trending. So I'm trying to update my wardrobe into something that will fit my age. This is my goal now. I was like rummaging through my wardrobe and removing things that I think like not my not age appropriate for me anymore and 
yeah, I'm sticking to pieces that are that can be used all through season. Okay, next will be um highlighter. I'm using the Becca highlighter, shimmering skin perfector in rose gold. Let's just put a little bit here on the high point. And a little bit on the nose. And in the lips. Cupid's bow. Guys, do you see the highlight? How it is? Amazing. Highlighter really brings out different look, I feel like. Okay, so next, after that, I draw in my eye my um, wing liner. I use this tattoo liner from Kat Von D. And this needs a little bit of concentration. So bear with me. Let's answer a question while doing this. How many siblings do you have? I have only one sibling. He's my half-brother. Okay. What is your go-to fast food order? Definitely a Big Mac from McDonald's or Big Tasty. I love Big Tasty. I don't know if it's available in other countries. But yeah, Big, Big Tasty McDonald's with large fries garlic mayo and sweet chili sauce and merienda that's my go-to mcdonald's order okay um next do you use pc or a mac i use a laptop but it's not mac it's hp <laughs> look the same I think this one is a little bit higher okay that's fine Do you have any bad habits? Let me think of something. Bad habits, well, sometimes I do smoke a cigarette, but I'm trying my best to quit smoking because it's not good for your lungs, especially now with this corona and it's targeting the respiratory system. I really try my best to stop smoking so yeah hopefully i totally stop now i just smoke maybe one stick per day maximum maximum two stick and yeah i i wish to totally stop smoking for the mascara i'm using this bad girl bang from benefit this is really nice i will show you what will be the impact on my on my um, eyelashes? Guys, this is just with one coat. I don't know if you can see. You can see the difference. It's really big difference. So I usually do two coats. Yeah, that's it. And it really boosts the eyelashes. Oh 
Okay. What is your favorite Netflix show? I don't have a favorite. Like, whatever is trending sometimes, that's what I watch. I'm currently watching Dating Around. It's really like a life... It's really uh, funny because it's like a life... What do you call that? It's like using Tinder in real life. There, there is this one person who's trying to date five person, and then after that, I think they, she will, he or she will choose um, who she will go out on a second date with. So you will really see, like, what are the questions people ask during the first date. It's really funny. Okay, so I'm done with the eyes and. Also, last thing that I put on my eyes is a little bit of sparkle on the inner corner just to give it a little bit of glow. I just put on a little bit here. And then I also use the highlighter. Okay, so last part will be the lipstick. For lipstick, I use this. Urban Decay 24 7 Glide On Lip Pencil in the shade 1993. Where is my small mirror? Yeah. This is like a nude shade, as you can see. So, this is what I usually use every day. For any lipstick, I, use, I only use this. And then, I'm currently using this Hourglass um, in the shade Girl Influencer. So, it's like this this pink nude shade. It's like a mauve shade. I don't know if you can see. But it's perfect for every day. Since we are also wearing face mask now. It's like wearing a lipstick but not really. So yeah, that's it. I mean, I don't put very, very heavy makeup on a daily basis. So, so guys, this is my final look. Uh, just last thing, I just spray this Urban Decay Makeup Setting Spray to help the makeup last longer. I, mean, I don't put this every day, but it really does make the makeup last longer. So yeah, this is the final look. I hope you guys like it. It's just simple, everyday summer vibes makeup so hope you guys like it and i hope you learn something i don't know if you do learn something but yeah and for the questions if you have any other questions that you want me to answer just comment down below maybe i will do another qa q a question uh q a video again Let's try to copy other people's makeup or something. And I will post like a question or a, you can just put, drop in your questions. If you really like this type of sit down makeup video tutorial, something. Yeah, I would definitely do this again. So comment down below if you enjoy this. I really, really want to hear your thoughts because it makes me more 
like interested to do makeup uh, future YouTube videos when I hear your feedback towards my my videos so yeah guys and also oh one last thing I wanted to say that in this video I'm going to do a giveaway well it's just a small giveaway but this is going to be only for my UAE followers because now it's really difficult to send packages overseas so this is just UAE giveaway all you have to do is drop in the comments down below your Instagram account of course follow me on YouTube subscribe and follow me on my Instagram account and then drop your Instagram account here in the comment of this video and so I can see that you are really like subscribed and following me on Instagram so yeah what you will get wait you will get this prize let me get it okay so you will win this pixie glow tonic um exfoliating toner and an eyeshadow palette from Kat Von D. so i'm giving this out to one lucky follower and subscriber so yeah i hope you guys join and subscribe to my channel i was looking at my stats and actually 70 percent of the people who watch my video are not subscribed so please do subscribe it's free so you can just always see when i upload which will be weekly for sure i will be i will try to do weekly videos now so yeah thank you so much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed and see you again next time bye